Bauer got a warning uh, from MLB about his logo on his belt. It's a whole, it's a whole thing. <laughs> Lisa, are you gonna miss me when I'm gone? I don't even think I can let you go. <laughs> you have to do that. Who's gonna give me kisses and say I love you all the time? <laughs> yeah, that's how the relationship is. <laughs> Every time we, we vlog when my aunt's driving, she can't, it's not even multitasking, but she Single, gets distracted. Singular tasking. Singular tasking. She did have her debut on the vlog though, and she read the comments, which I warned her. I was like, don't read comments. It's actually something she tells me a lot of times. I tell you not yes. to comment. And don't respond. Don't respond. Except saying. now that she was on the vlog, she read them. And someone said, your mom's hot. She's my aunt. But then, so. And I walked around with a smile for a good 48 hours. And then when I looked at the comment again, someone underneath had written to the person who said, your mom is hot. Are you on crack? <laughs> so now she's really... Now she's I'm very, sad. Now she's sad. So now... Young Rachel gets to teach her the Don't ways read the comments. of social media. Yeah, mm -hmm. and now it's my turn to do the teaching. Don't read the comments. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and whoever said that about me really hurt. It really hurts. I'm 56 years old. I do the best with what I have. <laughs> You're killing it in life. Thank you, honey bun. Yeah. Everyone's gonna be there for my dad's birthday, so it should be fun. It's the small white Lexus. Hi, the small little Aviva. She's like the only person I know smaller than me. It's the only reason I love her. Oh wait, the trunk's open. You can't like, really tell what's going on here. We're <laughs> piggybacking. <laughs> my little one. One of our other family, maybe my aunt, my great aunt, sent me to sent to my grandpa it's articles. I'm in them. We love people that read the newspaper, cut them out, and send them to me. It's so cute. All right, well, got a little coffee. Yeah. Cheers. All right, stuck inside on calls while they're all out in the hot tub, but I'm there in spirit. Are we gonna make it in that someday? One day. Going on a quick run. Going. All right, so finishing some calls, some emails, and then gonna head to dinner um, downtown in Santa Barbara with my family. So that should be fun. It's chilly here. You look nice. Thanks, so do you. Look at that fancy sweater. Grandpa Harvey. All right. This is my tax attorney. <laughs> Adam doesn't like my hair. He didn't say he didn't like it. He said it's big. big I, think, hair. I don't think I've ever 
worn something and Adam seen it and he didn't have some sort of comment. This is what having brothers is like. Well, she thinks I look like pebbles from the Flintstones, so. Pebbles. Thanks. I feel bad. His dad's that. favorite Instagram account is Kook Slams. Bye bye. What's up vlog? Uh, it is another week and full of lots of calls already. I had to talk to uh, the Dodgers briefly because uh, Bauer got a warning uh, from MLB about his logo on his belt. It's a whole, it's a whole thing. But um, look, I do think that players should be able to, you know, in subtle ways rep their their own personal logos. I understand other companies and corporate logos, that's different. But anyways, that's um that's what the rules are in the different professional leagues. So we had to remove remove those, um, dealt with that, um, some Yasiel stuff, and then I am recording a podcast with some of the driveline guys later today. So Alex Caravan and uh, Co. I don't know who the rest, if it's just him or who else. But anyways, that'll be fun. Then just catch up with Bauer on everything that's going on with him and uh, the housing situation for LA and all that fun stuff. So that's, that's my day. Okay, found my setup for the driveline podcast. Uh, hopefully my internet is good enough. Here we go. My sweet little light setup. <laughs> All right, guys. Finished uh, recording that podcast with Driveline. Lots of fun. And uh, now, now got some calls with with Bauer to go over his stuff. All right, guys. I am off to uh, the facility to turn left on North meet Desert with Drive. some of the guys. I think Bauer's actually having someone come uh, take pictures of his McLaren. It's been, it's been a day. Going, I think sometime this week, hopefully, um, to one of the American Ninja Warrior uh, training facilities. Gonna check it out. Still supposed to be doing that at the end of the month, but uh, I guess things haven't really gone as planned this spring training so I don't know if I'll be able to do it but we'll see I'm gonna try to so that's that's kind of the update also I'm sure some of you guys saw that um, Bauer did get in trouble for the uh, logo that he has on his belt I did not know that he had that um, he did used to wear it on his undershirt I knew that there are very uh, strict rules about uniforms and the way it works is you get one warning in your whole career um, for a uniform violation. So it doesn't reset every, um, every season. So after you get one, then you get, if you get any more, so like the first, the next violation is a thousand dollar fine uh, that you have to pay. The second time you get it busted for a violation you pay uh, I think it's 5,000 and then the next one is 10,000 and I don't think they have any subsequent um, 
it's not stated as to what the, the fine is for like the fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh. Bauer has asked me before what those are. <laughs> what the fee is, as he puts it. <laughs> I do think, look, I understand the corporate logo thing um, with the uniforms and because they do the sponsors, um, you know, like these are collectively bargained, um, you know, uh, rules that that all the leagues have. And I know in basketball, is it J.R. Smith or something, um, had to cover up. He had Supreme, that logo, tattooed on his leg. He had to cover up that entire thing. However, I understand that because that's like, that's a corporate logo. It's not his personally. I do think there has to be a, there should be a difference between a corporate logo and a player's personal logo. That's just my opinion, but I do think there is a, a distinction there and there should be a carve out for that. He got his warning and uh, we, will, we will have to deal with it. guys off to the ninja gym to go see if I'll be able to do this with minimal training or I'm gonna have to wait for another season because this is my first time in the gym the ninja gym guys that was so much fun but brutal my hands I feel like a gymnast all over again um so I gotta make a decision figure out if I'm gonna be able to compete in this or not I kind of want to train more but we'll see anyways now I got a business dinner to go to